So this island is like Hi, an squirrel. unexcavated part of the quarry that rewilded itself after it flooded into the lake. Pretty cool, huh? You know, when I was little, I used to think that islands just kind of would float in the middle of the water, kind of like an airbed. But I'm older and wiser now and realize that not everything's always as it seems. Kind of like how you thought you were just having a hot summer fling and then it turns into babysitting a big hairy man child who's all sad because you don't want to go steady with him and write him love letters every freaking day. And while we're talking about it, you don't mind that we're talking about it, right? Why? Why is it up to me to justify my feelings when he's the one who got all blah about it, you know? <sighs> yeah, you're being super bitchy. Oh, look. The metaphor in the narrative by mean of fork in the road. How fitting. Here's the big question. Do I take the high road, literally, and forget about it? Or do I continue on the path I'm on and keep ranting about my stupid dumb life? I guess since this isn't live, the choice is up to me. All right. Fuck it. Ah, oh, what the hell. We're in it now anyway. Well, and truly in the thick of it. Because you know what else? I was really excited for the next part of my life, you know? I mean, the summer was great. Oh, she's going to get next? killed. I mean, come on. I know by the time I post this, Hackett's Quarry will just be but a distant memory and... You know, it's just one night, and you have to make the most of all your opportunities, and yada, yada, yada. I guess... I just don't want to have to settle for what's around me, you know? <sighs> Abby sees me as this... confident person, but... really? I'm just desperate to stay afloat in a world where everyone wants to be different. All right, let's keep going to our death. We You know, I wouldn't blame Abby if she never wanted to speak to Emma again after the truth or dare thing. That was just That was just cold. This is actually kind of fun. I feel like this is the first time I've been alone all summer. Kind of like it. I guess that kind of reinforces the whole Jacob thing. I know the plan was for him to come get me, but now that I'm by myself, I kind of like it. Sorry, Jacob, if you're watching. Nothing personal. It's a me thing. We're cool, right? Yeah, we're cool. Mmm, not cool. I mean, who knows? Maybe in 50 years we'll bump into each other and be flooded with fond memories of that one amazing summer at Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. And that spark that changed our lives forever. Then we'll be like 70 year old lovers or whatever and have crazy walker sex. <laughs> hey, it could happen. Only time will tell, Jakey boy. And as they say, time makes fools of us all. But we will be the oldest, sexiest fools there ever were. <laughs> Until then, I gotta do my thing. I don't Sorry, think buddy. you're gonna live to be 70 if you keep acting like that. Anyway. Oh, look. That's, that's fun. Hmm, what's that? No. Thinking about it, how could this have been Mr. H when he was back at the lodge? Yeah, that's suspicious. Quoth it's the matches. Raven nevermore. Harbinger Hotel. Well, motel, not hotel. What? No. Take the matches. All right, well, I know she doesn't have anywhere to put them, but I'd carry them around. Mattress are so freaking useful. 
I think I'm actually gonna go back and go up the stairs if I can. Okay, so I can totally backtrack. It's kind of nice. Maybe we'll just take a look at this way. Yeah. Cuz you know, nothing could possibly go horribly wrong. This is so pretty. Like obviously this is where we're heading. Horror movie. Not too but... shabby. Well, literally is too shabby, but these views, oh man, you're going to blow your tops. There's also a zip line which eh, I guess you can watch me crap my pants on that thing. What the hell? I don't think that's here, aren't I? <laughs> I'm going to carpe this DM so damn hard it won't know what hit it. First, we got to get there. And there's still so much to talk about. Okay. I hope Abby's okay. Trying to make her desperately like earlier. less of a if bitch. If you didn't see it, I kind of sort of made out with Nick. But it was a dare. I'm not like a bitch or anything. Mm. Oh, and for context, Abby likes Nick. Well, actually, they like each other. In truth, I just wanted to fan the flames a little. Watching them stumble around each other like drunk jellyfish was exhausting. Poor kid was like a deer in headlights. It's cool, though. They're smart. They'll get it. I bet they're out there in the woods right now, just absolutely going for it. Not quite. Yeah, let's uh let's check this out before we car keys. Okay. Police car keys. Oh. I think this might be one of those I'm sorry, officer, I've no idea what you're talking about situations. So I'm just gonna go ahead and leave those right there. I think you should grab those. No okay. All right. And here we are. As promised. One extremely rickety and even more underwhelming treehouse. In another world, perhaps young Jacob and I would settle down here and play house together. Man, I hope that creep ass cop ain't home. gonna. What's that now? I forgot the children's bedtime. Well, now, that's a fine how do you do. That don't even make sense. <laughs> Take it all in, folks. That's the summer camp experience right there, and- I don't like that that oh, loaded. It seems somebody forgot to clear the place out. I guess one of the kids left their stuff, or maybe one of the guys back there? But I don't recognize this. Mm. Did you hear that? Looks like we have a choice on our hands. Do we snoop through someone else's belonging? Or do we open the spooky trap door and die a horrible, painful death? There are literally no right answers. Let's search the bag. Bag it is. And you know what? I'm putting some clothes on. This is all you're getting. Yep. 
Yeah, I don't think I'm, uh... I don't think I'm gonna open that trap door. That's not what I want to do right now. Hmm. Okay. Fun. Okay, so... I think there's something up there. And it is not gonna make me jump, I can promise you that much. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Goodbye, cruel world. Why would you the do this? Curtain is calling and there's no time for an encore. What? <laughs> yeah, that's about what I thought would happen. Oh, I just pissed I just pissed it off. Great. That has to be the cop. There's a window right there. strong enough to keep that thing in damn okay easy i got it he's okay sure okay you know let's go with that are you in pain no no sorry i'm just i'm really hungry we'll get you some food inside okay mm. Oh man, I can eat a horse. Well, I don't know if we'll be able to find you a horse, but maybe some granola. Oh, yuck, I hate granola. <laughs> okay. I got a tarot card. Cool. This will open the nurse's station. Should be plenty of stuff in there. Well, hopefully we can just get him cleaned up for now. I'll get you something to eat. I was about to say, we're still in- You and I are gonna find a landline. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, isn't there one in Mr. H's office? Yup. We'll come meet you. Copy that. I really hope they're gonna be okay. Do you think that whatever's left in the nurse's office is gonna cut it? Maybe. Caitlin knows Probably what she's not. doing. Does she? I, I mean, she wasn't even supposed to be working at the nurse's office this summer. She only filled in because some other girl didn't show up. It's better than nothing. <sighs> Come on, let's go call for backup. It's pretty weird to see this place so dead. Why is the you door open? down here at night while camp was in session? What? No, did Close you? Close the door. A couple times, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Where are you going? I, I... I... I thought I just heard my name. I didn't hear anything. Great. You know what that is? It's going, Dylan, close the damn door. 
Hey everyone, thank you so much for watching. I just want to take a minute to ask that if you haven't already, please take a second to like and subscribe if you'd like to see more. And if you're looking to show even more support, there's a link to my Patreon in the description below this video. You can see everything you get right here on the screen, and I'm always looking for more perk ideas from you guys, so let me know what you'd be into. I think that's about it. Bye guys!